The gallery originally was located uh, above uh, our present gallery, uh, upstairs. Um, and there was a shoe store in the building that we're in now. And when they uh, vacated, we moved downstairs. And our sales increased exponentially. <laughs> Obviously, it's a, a wonderful location. Being on Main Street, Main Street of any town is the epicenter. So to be able to put that into our, our address is important. But I think the neighbors that surround us, we, we were surrounded by uh, a very vibrant part of Main Street. I mean, there are different personalities of Main Street as you move from the, from the west to the east. Um, and consequently, we, I think we're in probably the best concentrated area. And we have recently become a real living community after dark with all of the con I think there's something like 27 condominiums now that are in the area which means that's a whole population of people who that's their neighborhood after dark it's their neighborhood during the day it's their neighborhood 24 hours so to be a part of that fabric I think makes it a wonderful wonderful location being on Main Street helps a lot because it is part of the art community. They're close together. We have First Fridays in which uh, Friday night we're open uh, with all the other galleries and it's a big event. And so um, it, it's nice to have traffic of art interested people. Plus we're very close to the opera. Again, for, for people who have an, an interest in the arts, I'm sure that expands not just to the theatrical arts, but also to the, uh, uh, to the physical arts. We have very good artists in this group now, and it helps you push yourself a little harder to be a better artist. And everybody can always be a better artist, just work harder at it. And they're very creative at Art Uptown. I like being around creative people. Ten years ago, I was uh, in a workshop and the uh, instructor said, you know, if you feel like your uh, drawings are, your paintings are too tight, try drawing with your non-dominant hand. And uh, I tried it and I loved it. It's been a wonderful uh, experience for me. I've uh, got paintings in national and shows now and recognition. Um, so it's, it's been just a lot of fun and uh, a real loosening up. You know, doing figurative work and knowing that there are a lot of uh, uh, circus performances around and uh, theatrical works like ballet, etc. Uh, it, it always feeds me to attend events such as those that are really pretty rare in other areas, particularly the, uh, the circus arts. That, uh, that it really is inspiring to, uh, to see those performers and what they can do. And I uh, often try and translate that experience uh, into the works that I do. One of the wonderful aspects of our group is, is the amount of diversity that we have there. Uh, there's cultural diversity, people who have come from uh, cultures near and far. There are, we have members, uh, for instance, Eleanor Merritt, who's unfortunately has recently passed, but she brought such a, a wonderful aspect and she a, was a well-known African-American artist whose uh, work was not only exemplary in the area, but throughout the United States. Uh, we have people who have come with um, publication skills. Patricia Sorg is a recently one of our artists who's Guatemalan. And yet, and she's written a wonderful book that's now out on the market and doing well. And we're going to be promoting her this next year. Uh, and so it's the, it's that kind of diversity that it's not just someone who paints or someone who sculpts, but the richness that is created by having um, members here to um, bring those talents to us. And and so art town, art uptown with uh, local artists adds a richness and a local flavor that is uh, powerful. And it reinforces just what talent exists within the Sarasota community. Well, the future for Art of Town, I think, is um, one that is quite exciting. And I like to think of ourselves as, because we're trying to always look forward, is that we're really, really important to the cultural infrastructure uh, of the city. 
course they call us the cultural coast for a good reason and that is that as a community we're so rich in so many ways with all of that we have available to us. So whether you're a patron of the arts, someone who just enjoys going to a concert, someone who just wants to stroll around a museum for the afternoon, or someone who just wants to take in the beauty, Sarasota offers all of that to us. So that makes a nat natural positioning for Art Uptown Gallery to be a part of that cultural experience.